speaking. California, here we go. In 1940, the film The Grapes of Wrath imprinted the tragedy of the Dust Bowl on the nation's consciousness. Hoping to capitalize on the movie's success, RCA Victor Records asked Guthrie for 12 songs about the disaster. One would be based on the movie and its main character, Tom Joad, a Dust Bowl migrant turned activist by his bitter experiences. And Woody said, Pete, you still got a typewriter? And I said, yep, I got one still. He says, can I use it for a few hours? And Woody sat right down and started typing. Tom Joad got out of the old McAllister pen. There he got his parole. After four long years on a man killing charge, Tom Joad come walking down the road, poor boy. Tom uh, Joad, he had a half gallon jug of wine, as I remember. Tom Joad, he met a truck driving man. There Finally, I got sleepy and I wasn't being of any help to him, so I, I went to sleep. From McAllister Pen on a charge called home, signed in the morning, there was Woody, sound asleep on the floor, and the ballad of Tom Joad was finished. Wherever men are fighting for their rights, that's where I'm gonna be more. That's John Steinbeck eventually heard Tom Joad and is said to have uh, remarked, that little son of a bitch has got my book in 17 stands that took me two years to write. <laughs> In the late spring, Guthrie recorded Tom, Joad, and 11 other songs. That old dust storm killed my baby, but it can't kill me, Lord, and it can't kill me. That I think the Dust Bowl ballads was the purest expression of Woody's first 1930s wave of creativity. The range of the kind of songs that Woody could write, from the jokey to the heartbreaking, was all there in that one album. I'm looking for a job at honest pay. He understood, you know, that you, you can't tell people anything, you gotta show them. I'm looking for a job at honest pay. He put you into those lives, he put you into those into those situations, and he made you feel it. 